it's time to get down to the science. We've been documenting this for five years. And what I thought was to be something of a hoax myself, I was very skeptical of these items. They didn't look right to me. There was things about them that, you know, they looked more modern than most pre-Hispanic pieces that are found. And the dates that we had seen preliminarily come back were older, which didn't make a lot of sense until you start looking at the walls down in South America. If you look at the walls and the construction, the bottoms of these, the oldest parts of these walls are the highest in terms of technology, and it gets worse over time. And I believe that's exactly what we're seeing with these pieces. It's taken a lot of effort to get a world-class laboratory and a world-class science team involved to be able to put their names on the line and find out if these pieces are of antiquity or not. And so we began by testing many different specimen from Awelos, from Tula. This is a piece of a tablet here that had broken from Tula Hildalgo. It was a great specimen piece to where we could gather information about the phosphorescent material, as well as the stone itself, which is a very interesting type of stone that we'll get to in a later video. This is probably the most clear evidence to me that these items are of antiquity. However, if you look here, you'll see these black spots. Some of them may be dirt, but others, as you'll see here on a slide that we're gonna pull up, they're clearly magnes. And the, the breakdown, when you look in, the magnes is actually adhered as part of the stone. It's not just something that's painted on. And when you really break it down in this type of science with scanning electron microscopes, you'll start to see that these things are are absolutely of antiquity. So between doing 3D scanning and getting every last detail of these pieces understood, we have taken this ring from Tula Hildalgo, which is a colorless image here. And there's magnes deposits on the surface. And we went and we zoomed into these and we broke it down with a scan that'll break down the metal uh, you know, and, and mineral compounds. And as you can see here, this is without the, the manganese. This is with the manganese. And clearly you can see the orange there. This is a, a scan by AI. You can pause and read this. It's uh, basically a, a, you know, an, an analysis that I asked it, you know, what are the chances of this scan showing an ancient carving and so, or something of antiquity? And this is what it said. So we have many more tests. This is just the tip of the iceberg. I wanted to bring each sample and each test into its own video to show you clearly what we're talking about. Look forward to the next one.